Hi guys, this is Satish. So, in the today's series 13, so we also we had uh, 12 successful series with lot of support from many of the budding CMS and the aspiring CMS. So, thank you very much for your time. So, I would like to appreciate you and your time, and uh, I would like to also uh, appreciate my friends' support who are directly or indirectly promoting my uh, channel across social media and uh, their friend circle. Yeah. So in the today's uh, topic, that is series 13, we are going to discuss about membership with ICMAI. So in the previous uh, series, we discussed what is CMA course, what is ICMA, what it does, benefits, how to enroll, which are the levels, courses, subjects, all those things we discussed. But how uh, we also discussed about the job, practice, all those things, right? So now in this video, membership with ICMAI. So after you qualify your final cost and management accountancy course, you should have a three years of practical experience. So once you qualify that, it is not the end. So it is just a starting point where you need to pick one field or one industry where you are interested and keep putting more effort to build a successful career and to reach the top position in any of the organizations. Yeah. So in the today's topic, membership with ICMAI. So if you have uh, qualified your cost and management accounting, that by fixing a CMA to your name, you should ensure that you are having practical experience and enroll as an associate member to the institute or associate membership with the institute. Okay, so you cannot prefer CMA followed by your name after you qualify CMA. So ensure you are a member, then you prefix CMA name. Yeah, so that is the second benefit. Third benefit mandatory if in case if you are starting your practice. You need to apply for certificate of practice for that becoming a member member with the uh, membership register with the ICMA is mandatory. So to achieve as a success, you also have need to have support from various uh, industry experts. So that is only possible if you have a unity. To have a unity, you need to ensure that you become a member and along with the member, you also get to know a lot of uh, members who are in the role, who are having a lot of experiences. So with that unity, we can achieve this success. And you can participate in a lot of initiatives which institute takes for the development of the nation and to contribute a lot of things from the CMA fraternity. So that is possible if you become a member with the institute. So you cannot prefix CMA has already mentioned to your name, only if you have become a member, associate member, you can add a CMA followed by your name. Remember CMA, it is just a degree and to become a superior, you need to have a CMA or FCMA that is your associate cost and management accountant or fellow cost and management accountant. So those two are superior than your CMA. So CMA you are qualified, now you should be a professional. So to be a professional, add a prefix your name. So to prefix your name, you need to enroll as a member. Okay, so these are the few benefits which I just thought of adding in this series. So it's your dream. So you're qualified, now you should add that name that is the CMA to your name, right? So that was your dream to qualify. And do you, do you really think any other details are required to justify for me and ask you to become a member? No, right? Isn't it? Yeah. So this is the video for the day. Hope you have uh, got the details about the membership in case if you are a student still. So do not worry. Just know the details required to become a member. And once you qualify your cost and management accountant, immediately taking the three years of practical experience become a member okay so with that we'll end the video for the day in case if you like the video hit the uh, thumbs up button and uh, like the video and uh, also hit the subscribe button and to support my initiative and uh, do share this is satish signing off for the day see you check around bye bye